The Long Prairie Gray Eagle Browerville wrestling team is turning some heads this season. With only one senior on the team, the Wolves are currently ranked number one in the entire state. Sports reporter Anthony Scott has more on their incredible season. Two, one, wrestle! The Long Prairie Gray Eagle Browerville wrestling team had an impressive finish coming in fourth place at the state tournament last year. And now this year, they are going for the gold. I think us being there last year will help us like, keep more focused on actually like winning state instead of just the experience of being there. The team lost five seniors from a year ago, but their youth will not stop the Wolves from accomplishing their goals. In wrestling, we've always said if you're seventh grade and you're in varsity, it doesn't matter if you wrestle seniors. We, we believe that they can beat them. If you're in varsity in our room, you know, you have a shot. Yeah, I think it makes everyone doubt us a little bit more. I think we're young and not, doesn't have, like, don't have enough experience. It's kind of nice having them doubt us. However, no one should be doubting the Wolves after what they accomplished on December 20th. When we beat Tracy Milroy, they were number one at the time. When we beat them, that was definitely kind of flipped the switch for us and realized we can actually do this. The Wolves are 20 and one, and they have challenged themselves throughout the year, competing against some Class 2A schools. To wrestle top-notch competition, it, you don't see that every day, and it only prepares us for the end. Two years ago, the Wolves were practicing in a hardwood gym, but now they have moved into this practice facility, and the results have reflected their move. It's dramatically helped on injuries. It's dramatically helped our practice times. Um, it's just, it's awesome that they gave us a dedicated space. Since their new practice facility was built, Long Prairie has 44 wins compared to only four losses, and they believe they can accomplish anything. To be in the position we are today, I don't think anybody believed it, but we did, you know, and um, once kids believe in stuff, you're dangerous. One, two, three. Whoa. Reporting from Long Prairie, Anthony Scott, Lakeland News. And the team will take the mat this Saturday for the Park Region Individual Conference Tournament. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.